Hey guys, my vapor here. Hope you're ready for a fun one. Hopefully a quick one. Um, we're going to be pushed for time here. I'm going to do something pretty crazy today. We're going to do six juice reviews in one video. Six different flavors. All the flavors we're going to be doing today are from Juicy Vapor. We are uh, vaping all of them 16 milligram. So they should give a pretty good amount of throat hit and a pretty good amount of flavor. It's all uh, reduced PG, 16 milligram juice. So we're going to be doing pralines and cream, Kahlua and cream, English toffee, uh, coffee, eggnog, and minty chocolate chip cheesecake. So we're going to cram all six of them in here. Um, since we got six to do, I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into it. First one we're going to do is the pralines and cream. One thing I'm going to mention while I drip this one away Every single one of these that I got, they come with a, a little tiny bottle that's called a flavor booster. Um, these are all handcrafted juices, so I'm assuming it's probably just the flavor concentrate that they use when they make the juice. It's come in small little bottles like that. I thought that was kind of neat, kind of unique. Gives you that extra flavor if you got a, a flavor that you don't think is quite strong. But let's go ahead and start with the pralines and cream, and we'll give this one a go. This one, it's gonna be a hard one to key. Um, I'm actually, I'm, I mean, it's it's great, it's good, but I'm getting, I'm getting kind of a coffee taste, a coffee taste from it. I'm not sure if any of you guys have tried mixing your own flavors, but this, it tastes. Let me see. It tastes and smells exactly like the Lorenz flavoring, the small Lorenz flavorings. They have a pralines and cream version. It tastes and it smells almost exactly like that, except there's a little bit of a hint of a, like a coffee or espresso type flavor. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's, that's exactly what it is. I don't know how else I'd describe pralines and cream to you. It does have the creamy taste to it, a creamy texture, and... Um, tastes exactly like the Lorenz flavor concentrate, but it has that coffee hint to it. So let's go ahead and swap out an atomizer to find another atomizer. I'm not using new atomizers, but they were all cleaned and blown out. So next we'll move on to the Kahlua and cream. Yeah, this one should be pretty interesting. The smell, it's, it's not a strong smell. It is a, I don't know if you can see that, it's a, it's a dark flavor, or a dark colored liquid. Uh, we got the tornado going too, by the way. Now that one's awesome. It tastes, it tastes exactly like a mixed Kahlua. Um, I don't know about exact, I mean it's, it's pretty accurate. The one thing I'm... I'm noticing on this one, and I, keep in mind, I haven't vaped these juices before. This is an actual first impression with these. Um, this one is kind of, it tastes like a Kahlua, but it has not really a menthol taste, but the menthol hit that you get in your mouth if you've ever smoked the menthol cigarette, it, it's kind of, that kicks it in your mouth, and it's interesting because it almost makes it taste like an alcoholish flavor, but it's definitely, definitely a Kahlua flavor. And I noticed that that menthol-y kind of feel that it leaves in your mouth, it's only on the inhale. As you as you exhale, that's where I'm getting just kind of a creamy taste. It, it's almost like it mellows out as it as it sits. Yeah. So if you're if you're looking for a Kahlua flavor, there's an accurate one right there. Accurate to Kahlua. I think that my biggest impression with that one was the the mentholish feel. That was that was kind of different. I love juices like that. I love like the soda juices when you get a good soda juice and it actually has the almost a feel, the tingling on your tongue of a carbonated beverage. That's awesome. Next, we're gonna do the English toffee. I haven't I haven't baked any of these. I haven't added any of the flavor boosters or anything to it yet. Then one, two, three. Sorry about the 
that time here. Alright, let's give it a go. Wow. This one here. It tastes exactly like it smells, and if you've ever bought those like English toffee hard candies, it tastes it tastes exactly like an English toffee hard candy. This one, it's it's I'll be honest, it's a little weak on the throat hit. I'm really getting little to no throat hit on this, so it has to be if you were just in the mood for something sweet, a nice sweet vape, but don't don't expect much of a throat hit. It's a good juice. It's exactly like the English toffee candies. I guess the throat hit isn't too entirely disappointing. Last time I bought an English toffee candy, I really wasn't in the mood for a punch in the back of the throat. let move on to another atomizer here. Next, we are going to try a coffee. Huge coffee drinker, so this one better not let me down. could go into a ton more detail if I were to narrow this down, but hey, let's have fun with it. Six new juices, how often do you get the opportunity to try six brand new juices all at once, right? Coffee. Accurate to what it's named after. It, it's definitely, definitely a coffee taste. It has kind of a kind of a creamy texture to it. It's not like a black coffee. It's a if you would picture a cup of coffee with a little bit of cream, a little bit of sugar in it. I mean, that, that's pretty accurate to what it is. Nothing, nothing fancy, no cappuccino type drink or anything. It's just like straight morning cup of coffee. And even though it is 16 milligram, that one's given a fairly decent throat hit. I didn't expect a ton of throat hit off of any of these being at 16 milligrams. Usually that's going to kick in once you're once you're at about 24, especially at 36. I find that 36 milligram for me, anyways, I can vape something at 36 milligram, and it completely changes the flavor too. But it does add that extra throat hit. Here's the one I'm waiting for here: eggnog. Definitely a seasonal taste, but we're blowing snow outside right now, so we're still in the season for it, even though Christmas is already gone. A couple drops in there. I'm going to save you guys some time here. Excuse the half-naked tornado, but I'm not going to keep screwing that end cap on. It would be, work a lot easier if I wasn't actually changing atomizers, but... This one, out of all of them that I've tried so far, this is the most accurate to the name. This, 100% on the dot, on the nose, This you're drinking a glass of eggnog. Wow. It's, you can notice the throat hit there. Um, I think you can actually taste like the eggnog spice in this, and I think that's what I'm feeling as the throat hit. It's... Yeah, but definitely spot on. Spot on with the eggnog. That's awesome. A great job to the guys at Juicy Vapor for that one. Especially that these are handcrafted juices. I mean, that's, that's awesome. So the last one we're going to do here is Mint Chocolate Chip Cheesecake. How's that for a huge flavor combination thrown into one bottle? The first thing that hits you on that is the mint. I mean, the, the mint just explodes in your mouth, and it, it kind of it calms it down once you start to taste that chocolate come through. I'm going to have to say on this one, though, that they are not accurate to what they named it as. This one, I'm going to say it's more or less, it's more or less key on to be named uh, like a mint chocolate chip ice cream. 
I'm not getting the cheesecake flavor, but it, it definitely, it's a nice cool vape with the menthol, and it tastes exactly like you just took a bite of mint chocolate chip ice cream. All right, guys, that's it. Six juices, one review. It's a whole lot of vapor and a whole lot of flavor. No daddies were hurt in the making of this video. <laughs> hey, guys, thanks for tuning in again. And until next time, Smy Vapor, signing off. Thank you.